video, we present a simple case with some calculations where we use more processes in parallel to do some work. So we use parallel serves on machines. We use Little's law and you must know something about the utilization of a process. This case text is in the PDF and this case is available on the website in Moodle. After you completed the questions, you can continue this video to see the answers. If you do not have this PDF, please pause the video in the next image when we show you the summary of the case and state the questions. You can calculate the case using Little's Law and remember that you have parallel services. So, a small recapitulation of the case. We have two machines that can do a certain job. The processing time for every machine is 20 minutes and on average Every 50 minutes, one product enters the system. We measured the queue and on average, five items were on queue. We asked the average waiting time in the queue, the total time for a product in the processing system and the utilization of the processes. Okay, let's start. We have two parallel machines or services and each service takes 20 minutes. Every 15 minutes a product enters the system, usually it comes in the queue first before it is handled by one of the two servers. On average, five products are in this queue. Let's start with the first question. What is the average waiting time in a queue? We use Little's law for this. To know this, we need the number of products in the queue. This is the work in progress and this is five. And we need the throughput. This is every 15 minutes or four per hour. So if we fill in the numbers, the average waiting time in the queue is 1.25 hours. So for the second question, we want to know the total time of a product, how long it stays in the system. Well, this is the time the product waits in the queue. This is 1.25 hours or 75 minutes and add up the time it takes to process one product. This is 20 minutes. So the total time is 95 minutes. The last question we asked is about the utilization of the service. So how much of the time are these services really working? We need the time that we are working and relate this to the time that we can work. The time we need to do the work is four per hour. But what we can do is a little bit more difficult. Every machine takes 20 minutes of processing time. So three products per hour per machine. As we have two service or machines, we can service six products per hour in total. The utilization in this case is 67%. So 67% of the time the services are working on a job. This is the next explanation of the case with two parallel services.